Hey everyone, Josh here with Fresh Start Customs, and today we're going to be covering how to find score, engrave, and cut within the WeCreate software. If you're brand new to WeCreate, um, their software is set up different than any other laser with the way that it's named. And uh, I get this question pretty often from new users here on how to do this. So I'm going to explain this really quick. I'm going to highlight the scored area here. And in order to get this, you need to do a line engrave. Instead of just having the word score here, they put line engrave. I don't know why they call it line engrave, but this is a score. Essentially what a score is, is it's doing a lighter cut option and it's not actually cutting through the board. It's just engraving on a cut path. So that is how you get score. I'm frequently getting questions about, um, I just bought a file online and it says to score this area or to score the blue lines or whatever color lines it is in that file and uh, the new owners of we create they don't know how to find the score option and this is it this is a line engrave i know this is pretty basic stuff but this will help out some new members so i wanted to create this for you the next up we have engrave so if you want to engrave like all the filled in area, that's uh, they call it fill engrave. Normally on most lasers is just called engrave. And then lastly, you have cut, which is cut. And that is the same on all lasers across the board there. So uh, if we create, if you're watching this, I recommend you changing um, the line engrave to the word score and fill engrave to the word engrave. It'll cause less confusion between people who get help from outside sources online versus just we creates sources here. But uh, for now, this is how the software is set up. That is how you find score is line engrave. How you change it into an actual engrave is fill engrave and how you change it to a cut is cut. Um, one last thing I do want to point out is for the engrave section. If you come over to the right hand side here, scroll down, you can then get your preset settings by clicking on this picture here. You can choose what setting you want. So let's say we like this setting here. We'll just click on it and it'll auto update your settings over on the right here. Um, you will not get this preview for the cut or the score if you scroll down. So just a heads up on that. I wanted to quickly point that out as well. I know this was a super short, quick video, but I really think this is gonna be beneficial to answer any newer members' questions about score in the future. If you guys have other uh, suggestions on videos or quick tips like this, let me know down in the comments below, and I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and like always, thanks for watching.